finally, just to uh, mention this on glycolysis, it's the output of um, ATP. Really common question to get. Now remember that in the earliest stages when we were phosphorylating um, our glucose molecule, we put in um, ATP to go from glucose to glucose 6-phosphate, and then we put in ATP again um, when we went to hexose 1,6 bisphosphate. Let's put the whole thing out. I've missed a step out there. If you can remember what it is, I'm not going to redo it. Give you something to do. So we put in two molecules of ATP. Um, then later on in the reaction, um, when we've got our last steps, um, we go from triose phosphate and we get ATP. Um, coming out as that's converted into intermediates and the intermediates then go to pyruvate and we also get ATP out. Okay. These steps, it's two ATP each because if you remember we've actually got two lots of triosphosphate. So another way I could have drawn that, I could have said we've gone from hexose 1,6 uh, bisphosphate And we've gone into triose phosphate, triose phosphate, intermediates, intermediates, pyruvate, pyruvate. And at this step, I've got ATP out because it's going on on both sides. I end up with. Um, Two lots of ATP, sorry, two lots of ATP at that step, two lots of ATP at that step, which is the same as what I've done over here. Um, I'll just put it in, even though it's not relevant here, but just to help you remember, we do also get two reduced NAD out there. So, what we've got here is we've put two ATP in, but we've got a total of four ATP um, out of. 4 ATP has been synthesized from ADP plus an inorganic phosphate. What we call the net output is 2 ATP. It's the difference between these two values. And do be careful on a question. If a question says how much ATP um, is synthesized in glycolysis, the answer would be 4 molecules. If it said what's the net amount of ATP produced, it would be 2 molecules. Okay, so do be careful, watch out for that. It's a trap. Um, it's not really a trap there, they're asking if you understand it, but make sure you're clear on it. If you're in any doubt, explain yourself. Say, uh, it's 4 ATP in total made, but 2 are used up in the process. That way you cover yourself.